Hello and welcome everybody. How's it going? Zeus Fury Omega here. And here we are bringing you another awesome episode of Arms Day Loda. Welcome, welcome everybody to this beautiful Wednesday morning. And let's check out what Bantry 44, the popular gunsmith at the tower, has of has for us today for Arms Day. All right, I'll go. All right, first up we have the Soros Auto Rifle ARI-41. Let's see. All right, yeah, we got our three choices. One with persistence, another one take a knee, and the other one with a glass half full. All right, let's check out the first one. Details. All right, it comes with the SLO-19 sights, SPO-28, which is one of my favorite sights because of that target acquisition. And SRO 37, not bad. All right, we got perfect balance, oil frame, speed reload, reinforced barrel, and persistence. Persistence, perfect balance, reinforced barrel, plus target. Ag oh my god, this is a freaking good roll. Forget the other two, let's grab that one. But before we make a hasty choice, let's see what these guys have. All right, we got the 1928, not bad, 37. They have the same size as the first. High caliber rounds, casket mag, speed reload, hand laid stock, take a knee. Not bad, next one. 1926, 37, SRL sights, not bad. All right, this one comes with fitted stock, oil frame, lightweight, small bore, glass half full. Not bad, but I love <laughs> that first one with the persistence. Persistence and perfect balance with reinforced barrel. Definitely a high, uh, definitely a number one pick. Had to keep this one clean or it jams. All right. Next up is the Thessian FR4 fusion rifle. Let's see. Spark IS-6, Flash HS-4, Replenish, Single Point Sling, Hand Light Stock, Range Finder, and Danger Close. Not bad. Spark IS-6, <clears throat> Flash HS4, Army of One, Snapshot, Oil Frame, Life Support, Eye of the Storm. Decent, but uh, let's see the next one. Alright, got the candle, IS2, Flash HS4, not bad. This one we have Grenadier, Single Point Sling, Oil Frame, Range Finder, Eye of the Storm. Hmm. This one had also range finder, but it had a uh, replenish, but it had hand light stock to give you that freaking perfect stability on it. I'm at a crossroad here. Uh, this is, gives you the range, but you lose a little bit with hand light stock and replenish. But that replenish, I don't really like that perk. This one you have range finder also, but you have something that gives your grenades back, which is better than replenish. But nothing for stability. If I go get there, we go. But it has single point sling. Um, uh, out of all of them, I actually would pick rank three. Next up, we got the Herja D. Alright, let's see the first one. We got the hollow sights with a thermal. Ooh, thermal favorite. We got crowd control, full auto. 
single point sling, hand loaded, and hand laid stock. Hand laid stock, full auto, crowd control with uh, thermal sights. Yeah, that one's gonna be fun. See next one. Post sights, assault, danger close, range finder, high caliber rounds, hand loaded, hand laid stock. Not bad. And they all come with hand laid stock. Be a win win. Hollow sights, long uh, oh no. L C range sights. I almost said something different. Alright, glass half full, full auto, single point sling, fitted stock, reinforced barrel. Not bad, not bad, but I like the first one better. Crowd control. Alright. Just right. Alright. Quick intermission, swap over to the warlock, pick up the last weapons. And once again I wish we could just get all five weapons on all our characters. Why they had to put a cap on it for three. Uh, anyway. How's it going, viewer? Alright, we got the... I already picked this one as one of my favorites, or... Because of persistence, to see... I'll test out the glass half full one, but that'll be later. Alright, now we got the Soros JLB 42 Rocket Launcher. Let's see. Start with rank 1 and see the perks. Oh, hey Red! How's it going? All right, we got Warhead, Soft Launch, Counter Mask, hmm. Heavy Payload, that's a good one. Speed Reload, Surplus, Perfect Balance, Lightweight. Why do they keep putting Perfect Balance on Rocket Launchers, man? They don't need it. Good, good. Let's see, what's the next one? We got Warhead, Linear Compensator, Hard Launch, Single Point Sling, Flare Magwell, Grenade and Horseshoes, once again Perfect Balance, and Snapshot. Oh, there's no good rockets, man. Confident or Confined Launch, Soft Launch, Counter Mass. Heavy Payload, Speed Reload, Reactive Reload, Javelin, Lightweight. Actually, this was not half bad. It has Javelin and Heavy Payload, Reactive Reload. 
Uh, it's better than the other two. Pick. All right, JLB forty-seven. Let's see what this tells us. All right, combined launch, soft launch, counter mass, single point sling, flare magwell, vacuum, javelin, snapshot. Uh, not very good perks. Only for javelin. All right, next one. Confined launch, linear compensator, counter mass, single point sling, speed reload, reactive reload, javelin, and quick draw. Javelin, reactive reload's not bad. Single point sling or speed reload. Eh. Man, what's up with these confined launches, man? Uh, linear compensator, counter mass, heavy payload, flare magwell, vacuum, javelin, lightweight. Well, at least this one meets some of the requirements I always say about a rocket launcher, javelin, and heavy payload. But none of these are good this week. I would kind of recommend if you really need a rocket launcher, I would get the rank 3 one. If not, pass and hold on to it for the next round, or just grab a random one and use it to break down for parts. But I'm going to pick number 3. Alright, I see the field test weapons. We got to make double kills with a hand cannon. We got a pulse rifle to use against the hive. What's the rocket launcher? Use against high ranking enemies, not bad. We got a shotgun to use in the crucible, iron banner weak, go nuts. And we got a Amalon sniper rifle to use against the fallen captains. Alright, weapon orders for next week. We got the Hockey, what is it? Zanri Nela or Nila D auto rifle. I wish they had more <laughs> uh, easier pronounceable names. We got the Soros ARI 41 auto rifle, the Soros DSI 43 scout rifle, and another JLB 47 rocket launcher from Soros. And we're going to end it off with a Hake Jinkokoku D shotgun. Not bad, not bad. So that's a beautiful Weapons Day loadout. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you next week.